Time now for Ask the Expert. People are jumping on the trendy bulletproof coffee bandwagon and are drinking it every morning. So is this an unhealthy indulgence or does it have healthy perks? We are joined this afternoon with our registered dietitian, Lori Meyer. Okay, first of all, I need a clue. What is bulletproof coffee? Well, it is really trendy right now. It's been trendy for the last several years, but it's really, everything old again is, is new because it's been around for centuries. It's really butter coffee, and it's mm. been drunk in the Himalayans and Ethiopia, Vietnam. They all have their versions of bullet coffee or butter coffee where they're I've adding some articles they're adding it. butter to their coffee uh, oh. in Tibet they add butter or yak butter in particular to their tea and you know a lot of these cultures are using it because they found that it may give them energy it's brought back now it's you know repopularized mm -hmm. because there was a biohacker in the Silicon Valley who found that it helped him lose weight <laughs> oh and it also improved his health and his fitness and his memory so just a slab of butter in the coffee well ex essentially that's what it is bulletproof coffee you first you start with a cup of coffee mm -hmm. And then you're going to add one to two tablespoons of MCT oil. And MCT right is it's a, it's part of the fr a fraction of the coconut oil. And if you don't have it, you can use coconut oil. Okay. Which is but here. The, and then the other ingredient is a grass-fed butter. So margarine certainly is not going to work. And a regular butter is probably not going to get the same effects. Okay. But it has to be from grazing cows. And so a tablespoon of each of those in with the coffee. And then you really you don't want to just stir it because it's going to be kind of lumpy. Right. Put it, put it in the blender. And, oh, and mix whiz, it, whiz oh. it up, and it kind of looks like a latte, and people love it. So I don't know if you want to. I want to try it too. Try it. That one's still nice Lori. and warm. I've been wanting to try this for a long time. You're not going to drink after me. I'll drink so on the other from side. The other side. <laughs> so what did you think? What'd you think? Do you it's have, bitter. Do you, do you have more energy? Oh, feel, I'm ready to take better. on the world, Lori. I feel better already. Well, and see, and those are some of the, oh. the benefits. There is an aftertaste, though. There's an aftertaste. Bad. Bad. You're, you're getting benefits from the coffee. Mm -hmm. I just need a little and sugar also, in there. <laughs> well, and, and, you know, that's, that's kind of not going to help with the weight loss if you have the sugar. <laughs> but, I mean, some of the benefits you're getting from the coffee, the MCT, and the butter itself, they're finding that we're seeing some improved energy and alertness, improved mem memory and focus. It can aid fat metabolism and weight loss if you're using the MCT and the grass-fed butter because both of those are going to be more thermogenic and they are going to aid weight loss. However, I'm going to tell you, if you eat a crappy diet and you just drink a cup of this, you're still not, not going to lose help. any weight. And then we also find that it may also help with cancer and diabetes <laughs> and Parkinson's disease. So there could be some health benefits to this. But so is there any downside to it? Well, the downside is it might not be for everybody. And certainly if you're pregnant, we don't recommend that you drink a lot of caffeine. Um, people who have insomnia, people who have arrhythmias, this could end up being a problem. Or if you have really um, stress and, and adrenal fatigue, this could end up stressing you more with the caffeine. But then I recommend you could make an herbal tea or a decaffeinated tea and with, this, this is a with the butter with the butter and the and the MCT this is a turmeric and ginger tea and people love that and they find that that ginger really zips them up so there are some alternatives that all you right could do. time for you to try it at home guys <laughs> got a question for our experts email them at ask the expert at todays tmj4.com you can also leave a voice voicemail the number is right there on your screen